By 2030, the global economy could face a staggering impact of up to $3 trillion due to a critical issue. This as animals in certain countries may not have access to the antibiotics needed to fight antimicrobial concentrations in meat. This according to Dr. Rajiv Nagasar, chairman of the National Multisectoral Coordination Committee, whose sole objective is to combat antimicrobial resistance. Dr. Nagasar was speaking on TDT's Now Morning Show when he made the statement. Imagine a world where food production is reduced, where animal who are treated with antibiotics, they are no longer able to be treated with these antibiotics, and you have deaths of these animals, and thus a reduction in supply mm -hmm. to, the, to the global food chain, and especially the low-income countries. Right. They provide a lot of the food. They may be using antimicrobials, which may have a certain concentration in the uh, animals or, or crops, and there may be trade restrictions because of those concentrations. Mm. And that could have a 1 trillion to 3.4 trillion effect on GDP by 2030. Dr. Nagasa also spoke about the decrease in the number of antibiotics being manufactured and the negative impacts it can have. There's a limited number of antibiotics. Mm. Um, it, from the 1970s onwards, there has been a drastic reduction in the supply of new antibiotics to, to the market. And it costs over a billion dollars to bring an antibiotic to the market. Right, uh, maybe around there. Right. Okay. That's that. It's, it's, it's very costly. Okay. And some some companies just don't bother anymore, and so they're forming partnerships with um, organizations like the Wellcome Trust, the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, and so on, so mm -hmm. that they can keep antibiotics um, continuing to be developed. 